what is this girl up to today all right guys i hope you guys are having a fantastic day so far welcome stellas and subscribers stellas and lovers stellas and family thank you all so what is where is this from this is from e-tech city e-tech city remember e-tech city they gave me this nutritional scale they sent me something else for me to review, another product for me to review. So as you can see, it takes C. Go check them out. Package wrapped. It says fragile on the box. So let's see what's in here. Now let us unveil. This right here. Let's pull it. Okay. So let's make some room here. So this is um, you guys can see a smart fitness scale. E Tech City. Alright, E Tech City, E Tech City, City, City. <laughs> I'm so excited. So smart fitness fitness scale and they have the specification the weight capacity and like i said it goes up to 400 pounds that's a lot you know that is a lot okay omg instructions so these are the instructions and i like one thing i like about etech city is like their um their product works with an app you know, because these days, who has time to carry pen and paper around? You know, no one does. So you want to keep everything on your smartphone or on your computer to keep it on the go. Now, this is what I'm talking about. This is so fancy. This is so fancy. Look at this. So it gives you, and also it gives you a little instructions on how to, I mean, get started, how to turn it on and how to use it and how to weigh yourself so that you get the accurate measurement, you know. And oh, how, it uses the same V-Sync and, app and then from it, the scale, yeah, the it other use, scale. Yep, so it uses, so I'm going to get everybody in the household, we are going to weigh ourselves and see how much we weigh. <laughs> this is nice. So, yeah, this uses the V-Sync app as well. So like I said, it will be easy. Check the link for our other yeah. video on the So I'll be putting scale. this to use. And I'm really going to be using this with my weight loss journey as well. You guys know I've been talking about losing weight since I had a baby. And so this 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 will come very um, handy. I do have I did have a skill. I do have a skill, but a um it did not have the body fat and all that. So this will be very helpful so the scale also comes with the tape measure you know you can be measuring your waist your arm your thigh your legs wherever you measurable your neck you it's know for the wherever, bmi yeah you know whatever is measurable you just measure it um if, like if you want to lose weight if you want to lose inches of your thighs your leg your arms you just have to you can measure it put it in the app so this is really nice and i like that it has its own container so I'm going to put this to a test right now. <laughs> this is what I wanted. Nobody was this. Nobody was that. Oh. <laughs> you look. The app, probably. <coughs> okay, we have to do that. It's not going to tell you just by standing on it. Do, don't you have the V-Sync app? So I'm going to measure myself again. We have the app going. Remember, I have clothes on. <laughs> Those got to be like 20-pound clothes, right? No. So, it says okay. crash three times. So it's get off. It. So get off. All right, it says, did you weigh in? Yes. 
Okay, so now we are using the app. It's going to tell me. All right, you put in other information for for I set it up, and here's telling you your numbers. Okay. Twenty nine point seven BMI, forty one forty two percent body fat, hundred six pounds fat free body weight, twenty six percent subcutaneous fat, nine percent visceral fat. How did they get that? Uh, anyway, this is cool. Okay, this is graphs. cool. So basically, I'm fat. <laughs> Um, yeah, so basically I'm fat. Yeah, do I need to lose weight? Yes, so I will be using this scale. I like it. I like it how it sinks in with the app. And Don't break it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how it sinks into the app and you know, this is going to be really, really amazing. All right guys, Steve here again just to continue on with this video. We've looked into this app a little bit more and we found out that if you click on things like the weight or the BMI or the body fat it brings up a lot of good information uh, on what it actually means the weight of course it shows you if you're in the uh, the right zone for your BMI the uh, BMI of course explains what our body mass index is and explains you know where you need to be on this spectrum it shows a uh, body fat percentage and uh, I guess what it means for good health of course, it shows your fat-free body weight, which includes uh, water, bone, organs, and muscles. And so it's also called lean body mass. Maybe you've heard of that term before. And so Stella's in the standard there. You can see it's, uh, it's coded by color. So if it's uh, blue, it's low. It's, if it's yellow, it's high. And green, you're good. So we're a little bit high on the weight. No surprise. The BMI is, is, is up there. The body fat is way up there. Okay, subcutaneous fat's even high as well. Visceral fat is okay, it's in the green zone. And then uh, our fat-free body weight seems uh, standard or normal. So that's just a couple of things here. It also breaks it down a little bit more on uh, you know, what it means, the whole percentage of your body mass there. So you got muscle mass, bone mass, body water, protein. So this is all just calculations based on your height and the measurements that you submit to this app. So sorry, we're getting a little focus issues here. There we go. <clears throat> so let's try here. We talk about subcutaneous fat, and uh, let's see what else we have in here. Oh, these are just some of the other things down here. So you got BMR, which uh, basal metabolic rate. So uh, it just shows how much you burn while doing nothing. So that's a pretty cool one. If you're a high metabolism person like me, you'd probably be up in this yellow region. All right, for the protein, it's going to show uh, basically the, your percentage of protein and your metabolic age. So uh, this is again Stella's measurements and she's right up there in the uh, uh, younger metabolic age. So that's that's positive. Uh, muscle mass seems a little low. Bone mass seems almost on the standard. I don't know how they really determine all this. And then body water is almost at standard. So not too far from being in really healthy zones. Like, uh, like she was saying, it's mainly about losing the weight, uh, the body fat, and uh, getting the subcutaneous fat down. So more on that journey as we continue, but I wanted to wrap this video up and say thank you guys for watching. Subscribe, share, like, comment, and uh, we'll see you on the next review. God bless.